Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. So in this video, Jogi says hello and uh, he's going to sit by side. And in this video, I am going to color in, continue this page. And this is taken from um, no other than Johanna Busfet's Rooms of Wonder, if you are new here. So yeah, I'm going to uh, continue this part here and probably the tree, this part. So I'm going to use a lot of dark colors because it's like, you know, in dark uh, place. Uh, and previously I did this part here with uh, sepia so I'm going to continue it and am I recording? I did not record when I you know, lost the footage while I was doing this part so this is sepia and that's this bottom part So this part, we shall finish this part is this. And I think this is part of the chair, armchair. <coughs> it's uh, like dark anyway. So probably not too visible and I'm going to add black Sorry, oh, Jogi just fell over. Uh, raspberry to turn this part back in. Yeah, this part, I'm going to use a bit of CP as well. Just to, you know, give it more shadow. Hopefully it's visible. I think I'm going to <coughs> zoom you in a bit more. Yeah, slightly better, sorry. Right, put this aside. This is uh, sepia. And I'm going to use a bit of, um, let me see, dark brown. Yeah, and I'm going to just <coughs> blend it in with, um, if I can find my color pencil, 
Mm. I'm just going to use this blender. The wind blender and blend it in. That will work too. So now this part here, the grass part, uh, it'd be like very dark. So I thought I would use something like um, marine green. Yeah, <coughs> zoom it a little bit more. <coughs> yeah, so this part here, the base is like a marine green. <coughs> So, <clears throat> any more this type of leaves? Yeah. Mm, I remember marine green. And then I'll use, uh, let me see, dark green. Mm. Mm. Yeah, dark green. Marine green, dark green. I'll blend it in with olive green. This top part here, mm. I'll use fine peel. And a bit of a black. green either, either kelp green or olive green so we layer them and blend them in and the top part here very lightly and blend them in with a uh, lime peel For the light. Mm. 
maybe a little bit of um, lemon yellow you know just for the light sort of thing and this part here um the lamp oops sorry uh puppy red just a tiny bit and then i'm going to use uh canary yellow and blend it in with a uh, sunburst yellow and this part here the whole thing i'm just going to use very lightly uh, deco yellow Uh, canary yellow give it a bit of a yellow here I'm gonna rub this back off The back here, oh, oh, I would uh, think it would be like um, this color, which I was thinking, um, this artichoke color. No, this one, uh, moss green. Where was the color I used? Uh, I was thinking of. Uh, yeah, moss green and marine green. Sorry, yeah, marine green. Marine green and moss green will be a bit like, you know, this is this is moss green. Oh, this is marine green, and this is moss green. So marine green has a bit just a, a tad darker so but they're all of the same sort of uh, family so marine green This is the tree stump. Now I'm going to finish this background here. Just I'll uh, give it a base of uh, a marine green. Then I'll come back when I'm done. So I've pre-colored this part with marine green, and now I'm going to do this top part here, uh, and I'll slowly blend it in. You know, at a later time. So I'm going to use Kelly green. 
um, I'm using this like a powdery sort of uh, green to give it a bit of a misty sort of a faded uh, look. So this is over over marine green. And then I'm going to blend it in with, um, uh, where's my marine green? This is kelp green. Uh, when you need the marine green, where is it? Oh no. I... There, I found it, marine green. And go over it. The base was marine green, so I'm just going to use marine green and Kelly green over it. And this part here, I'm going to use this set green light for the top. And I'm going to use the blender pencil, um, blend it in to mush everything up. Yeah, like that. And then probably I'll just use a little bit of a black for the shadow bits here, giving it a bit of a depth. And this part, um, marine green. Kelly green. I'll blend it again with marine green, go over it with marine green. I assume these are bushes, but it's in the background, so it's like a bit um, blurred. And just layer over it with the marine green and uh, Kelly green with a few layers. Play around with uh, marine green and uh, Kelly green. This part here. Sap hmm. green light. Oops.
um, Kelly Green, ah, uh, sorry, uh, Marine Green. This alternate Kelly Green. And this part here, the back here, I'm just going to use black. Very, very lightly. Give it a bit of a shadow. And blend it in with Kelly Green. I blend the pencil. It's here. My hands. And this part here, I think I'm going to use um, this a uh, pill sage. So this is how I would colour in this background here, Kelly Green, the bushes. And... Um, Marine green. The base was initially marine green. And then um Kelly Green Black And I'll use some um, Olive Green mm, Or maybe yeah, olive green, cap green, olive green, cap green, doesn't matter, cap green, cap green. Blend it with the black. Blend the pencil, mesh them all in. Blend the pencil helps you to fill in all the gaps, the white gaps. I could uh, layer more, but it's just a shortcut to layer it. I know, to blend it. See, you get the effect. Uh, I would probably just uh, layer more of this cap green or marine green, it doesn't matter. Till I'm happy with how it looks. So this, this background would be marine green, kelp green, kelly green black and blend the pencil uh, 
Kelly Green. Yeah, just play play around. And I'm not happy with you know this is white streaks. It's, it's the it's the tooth of the paper. So I am going to uh, add a bit more uh, marine green. And then blend it back in the blender pencil. Then it would take the, it would try to, you know, cover in the tooth. Yeah, like that. Uh, maybe a bit of a very, very lightly black. And, uh, Um, blend it back in with um, moss green, um, marine green. Yeah, and Kelly green, and set green light uh, here and there, you know, to give it a bit of a lighter effect on some parts here. And set green light. Kelly green. Um, cup green. of a black here to continue this part cap green Yeah, and uh, Kelly Green. Yeah, that's how I color this background. So I will probably use all these colors again and to complete the whole uh, part here. So I'll see you in the next part, uh, you know, when I'm done with this. So till my next video, take care and happy coloring. Bye-bye.